Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be Halloween school lunch ideas for your little ones. I like to pack my son's lunch according to each holiday so I do try to make it a little fun and a little festive for him. He loves it when I do these types of things. The first day that I packed him his Halloween themed lunch he came home so happy talking about how his lunch was Halloween themed and that all his friends loved it. So it puts a smile on my face that he really enjoys when I do these little things for him. So I'm gonna give you five different ideas for Halloween at school lunches for your little ones. Just an FYI, my son is super, super picky. I mentioned it in his previous lunch ideas that I shared with you guys that he did have food sensory issues and he still does have it. So packing lunches for him is very hard just because he's very particular and he only eats certain foods. So you're going to see a few repeats, but I do try to change it up as much as possible. And also I did film this video when he only went to school for three days out of the week because he was about to go on fall break, but you are still going to see five lunch ideas. One of the days is a lunch that he ate at home, but it definitely would be something that I would still pack for him for lunch. And then Friday's lunch is technically today's lunch, which is Tuesday. I wanted you guys to get five ideas. So I threw in today's lunch and just said it was Friday's lunch. So yes, you are going to see five Halloween school lunch ideas. Hopefully you guys enjoy these Halloween school lunch ideas. So now let's just jump right into my five Halloween school lunch ideas for your little ones. Okay guys, so this is going to be Ryan's Monday lunch that I have prepared for him. I made him a peanut butter jelly sandwich and used a cookie cutter of a pumpkin. Underneath, I just placed a cute little Halloween napkin. Then over here to the side, I have two Oreo cookies. One has a pumpkin, the other one has a skull, and then it does have the orange filling in the center. Then he has some baby carrots, and then I just placed a skull and a bat ring over his carrots. Over here to his afternoon snack, I gave him an Annie's gluten-free oatmeal cookie bar and I just placed a pumpkin sticker on it. And then in this Happy Halloween Ziploc bag, I just placed these Belveda snacks in blueberry. And then I also prepared him a miniature water and it has a cute little ghost on it. And this is what I have prepared for his Monday lunch and snack. Okay guys, so for Ryan's Tuesday lunch, this is what I prepared for him. I made him a Lunchable from home. So I sliced up some apples and I put some of these spider rings on top of his apples. Then over there, I put a pumpkin stick. Then over here in the pumpkin skewer, I did put a few pieces of lunch meat on it. And then I added some crackers and I put it in this Halloween cupcake liner so he can eat the crackers with his lunch meat. Then as a sweet treat, I just gave him some jello and placed some Halloween stickers on his jello along with a Halloween napkin. Now for his afternoon snack, he just has some plain Cheerios in this Halloween Ziploc bag. And then in this pumpkin bag, I have a Cascade Farm chocolate chip granola bar. And then of course he has a water bottle. So for Ryan's Wednesday lunch, this is what I prepared for him. So he has a plain bagel and I decided to put some vampire teeth in the center of his bagel. Then he has some more baby carrots. I just put in a Halloween cupcake liner and then I added a spider and bat ring. Then he has some fresh cut up strawberries and then I gave him a pumpkin stick so he can eat his strawberries with. Then he also has some strawberry banana yogurt. I decided to sprinkle some Halloween sprinkles on top, but he was not a fan because he says sprinkles is only for ice cream, so I won't be doing that again. And the yogurt is the Stonyfield Organic Kids. Then for his afternoon snack, he has some Halloween pretzels. They're so cute. They are bats and pumpkins. And the brand of these pretzels is this brand right here. I bought from Walmart. Ryan loved them. Then also he has a granola bar for his afternoon snack as well, or it's more like a protein bar and he loves these as well. It's I think chocolate and peanut butter. And then of course he has a bottle of water. Moving on to Ryan's Thursday lunch. As you guys can see, he ate lunch at home this day. He wasn't really hungry, so I just made him some hot dogs. I try to make the hot dogs look like spiders. They don't really look like spiders, but hey, I tried. And then my son is weird. He doesn't like his hot dogs inside of the bread. He usually just likes a slice of bread on the side. So I toasted it and shaped it as a pumpkin. Then he has some fresh cut up grapes with a pumpkin skewer on it because he likes to 
eat his fruit with these little pumpkin sticks so I usually always throw it in for him to use then he also had some water and then I told him if he ate all his lunch he can have these black forest little monster Halloween fruit snacks now for this last Halloween lunch idea, I did try to switch it up a little bit because I like to try to switch it up as much as possible. So for this idea, I did some breakfast. So he has some French toast sticks that I still have to put in the toaster. I usually do that right before I leave the house. Then he has some fresh strawberries on a pumpkin skewer and also some cucumbers. And I put some bat rings on top of his cucumbers. Then I have a little bit of syrup in this little container for him to dip his French toast sticks in. Then for his afternoon snacks, he has these Annie's Cheddar Squares. They're pretty much the same exact thing as Cheez-Its. And then he also has this organic Z-Bar and oatmeal cookie. He loves these. And then of course he has a water bottle and this one is a pumpkin jack-o'-lantern. And so anything that is usually pre-packaged, then I usually always try to just put some fun Halloween stickers on them to make them more festive. Okay guys, so that is going to end my five Halloween school lunch ideas for your kids. Now my son, like I said, is super, super picky when it comes to eating, so I did try to get as creative as I could. Now all of these things that I bought for his lunch was purchased, I think from Dollar Tree. I'm pretty sure everything was purchased from my local Dollar Tree other than the pumpkin cutter, the pumpkin cutter was purchased from my grocery store, but everything else is super affordable from Dollar Tree. If you're looking for other lunch ideas that are holiday themed, definitely go on Pinterest. This is where I got most of my lunch ideas to pack for my son. They have a ton of different ideas. If your kids are not picky, you guys can do so many different things for their lunches. So definitely check out Pinterest. And I really hope that you guys enjoyed today's school lunch ideas, Halloween themed. If you did, please remember to give my video a big thumbs up. It definitely helps out my channel. Also, if you have not already, I would love to have you join my YouTube family and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to turn on your notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my future videos that I do upload. Also, comment down below if you guys would like me to continue doing school lunch ideas for each holiday. So the next holiday is Thanksgiving, so maybe I can do a Thanksgiving and Christmas themed one. If you guys would like me to do that, then comment down below and let me know and I will definitely film another school holiday lunch ideas for you guys. As always, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video.